The Princess of Wales has been working from home on her early years project to improve the lives of babies, as she eases back into normal life after her abdominal surgery, Kensington Palace confirmed that she had been kept up to date with her campaign and the overwhelmingly positive results of a study she inspired that IT comes after a security breach emerged this week in which members of staff at the private hospital where the princess was treated allegedly attempted to access her medical records. Three workers have reportedly been placed under investigation by the London Clinic, the Princess's Royal Foundation Centre for Early Childhood has funded a trial of a baby observation tool, which is to be used by health visitors to improve how they spot signs of social and emotional development in young children, with the results being published on Thursday. Having personally suggested that the tool could be used in Britain after seeing a similar system during a royal visit to Denmark, the Princess has been particularly invested in the four-month trial. A spokesman for Kensington Palace said, the princess has been kept updated throughout the process. On Wednesday, other members of the royal family were seen carrying out public duties as normal despite the continued social media storm over the princess's edited Mothering Sunday photo. The Prince of Wales made a visit to Comermere Barracks in Windsor, as the Colonel of the Welsh Guards, while the Queen represented the monarch on a public engagement in the Isle of Man. The King, meanwhile, was pictured leaving his London residence in a separate car ahead of his wife as royal well-wishers lined the mall to wave to their majesties, the comment from Kensington Palace is the first official update on the princess's early years' work since her recovery from surgery in January, during which she has been taken off public duties, ordinarily. She would have been expected to undertake engagements relating to the study's publication. Instead, she has been at home recovering and is just starting to get back on her feet for small outings, including to a Windsor farm shop at the weekend. The Princess of Wales's Centre for Early Childhood will on Thursday report the results of a study conducted in two NHS trusts by the Institute of Health Visiting and the University of Oxford. It asked health visitors to use a version of a tool known as the Alarm Distress Baby Scale, ADBB, which focuses on a baby's social behaviors such as I. Contact, facial expression, vocalization and activity levels, to help experts and families better understand the ways babies express their feelings.